Hello and welcome to Basic Two Tech for students, teachers, and math education. The subject of today's video is missed operation with and without parentheses. This is part two of our basic math series. So if you have not watched the first part of this series, please click the link above. Before we begin the subject of today, I want to introduce us to board mass rule. Remember, my aim for this series is to help you understand the basic foundation or fundamentals of maths. And board mass is one of the foundational concepts in mathematics. Now, what is board mass? Board mass states that mathematical expressions with multiple operations need to be solved from left to right in the order of board mass. In this case, it is saying that if we are given a question that has multiple operations, like addition, subtraction, division, multiplication, brackets we have to solve from left to right let's look at some examples let's look at missed operations without parentheses so here is our first uh, question as you can see we're asked to find the value of 17 plus 15 divided by 3. so to solve this we use the board mass rule, which states that we have to solve the question from left to right in the order of board mass. In this case, we are given two operations. We are given addition and division. And if you look at the order of arrangement in board mass, division comes before addition. So the first thing we do here is to divide before we add okay so therefore we have we have 17 17 plus so 15 divided by 3 15 divided by 3 is 5 because 5 times 3 is 15 so 15 divided by 3 is 5 so we have 5 Next is 17 plus 5. So 17 plus 5. 7 plus 5 is, is 12. We write down 2. We put 1 on our next column. So 1 plus 1 is 2. So therefore, 17 plus 5 is 22. That is our final answer. Let's take a look at another example. So in this case, we're asked to find the value of 30 minus 12 divided by 4 times 4. Again, we look at our board mass rule. In this question, division comes before multiplication, and then subtraction. So in this case, we have to divide first. We divide, then we multiply then we subtract all right so let's go so we have 30 we have 30 minus 12 divided by 4 now 12 divided by 4 we give us 3 because 3 times 4 is 12 so 12 divided by 4 is 3 times 4 so our next operation is to multiply so we have to multiply 3 times 4 so we have 30 minus 3 times 4 we are asked to multiply 3 by 4 so what we do is that we find the sum of 3 in 4 places so we have um, 1 2 3 1 2 3 one, two, three, one, two, three. That's one, two, three, four. So 
3 times 4 is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So 3 times 4 is 12, so we have minus 12. So what next is 30 minus 12. So 30 minus 12. Let me rub this off. So 30 minus 12, 30 minus 12. So 0 minus 2 cannot. What we do is that we take 1 from 3. Here becomes 10. Then 3 minus 1 becomes 2. So 10 minus 2 is 8. And 2 minus 1 is 1. So that means that 30 minus 2 is 18. That is our final answer. Operations with parentheses. When we say parentheses, we mean operations having a bracket. Let's look at an example that involves operations with parentheses. So here is our first example. We are asked to find the value of 7 times open bracket and close the bracket 50 minus 4. If you look at our board mass rule, our bracket comes before multiplication and also comes before subtraction. So what we do in this case is to first evaluate whatever is in the bracket. So even though multiplication comes before subtraction, but the fact that subtraction is within the bracket, we evaluate 50 minus 4 before we multiply. So the bracket comes before multiplication. So we have to open this bracket by solving or evaluating whatever is in the bracket. So we have 7 times 15 minus 4, 15 minus 4. So 5 minus 4 is 1. So 1 is 1. So that's 11. So 15 minus 4 is 11. What next is 7 times 11? Let's work out 7 times 11. So 7 times 11 is 11 times 7. 7 times 1 is 7. And 7 times 1 is 7. So 7 times 11 is 77. That is our final answer. Here we have about three operations. We have division, we have a bracket, we have multiplication, and we have addition. Again, according to Bodmer's rule, we have to solve the bracket first. That means that we have to solve whatever is in the bracket before we start any other operation because bracket comes before multiplication, addition, and division. So we solve whatever is in the bracket first. So we solve this first, then we divide, then we add. All right. So, so we have 30 divide 2 times 3. Again, 2 times 3 means that we find the sum of 2 in 3 places. So we have 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2. That's 1, 2, 3. So 2 times 3 is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So 2 times 3 is 6 plus 2. All right. So now we have two operations. We have division and addition. What comes next will be to divide. So 30 divided by 6. What we do is this. We think of a number. What number we multiply 6 to give us 30? That number is 5. 5 times 6 is 30. So that means that 
30 divided by 6 or 6 divided by 30 is 5. So 30 divided by 6 gives us 5 plus 2. So 5 plus 2 is 7. So this is our final answer. So as you can see, so as you can see, bot mass is a very important concept in basic mathematics. So you are advised to please take our time to study bot mass if you want to understand how to solve questions or expressions involving missed operations. So thanks for watching and see you in the next video.